Good morning everyone. It's Wednesday. As you can see, it's just before well, 10 to 11. So I'm running a bit slow this morning. I didn't actually get up until 5.30, which is kind of ladyish for me. Uh, haven't been very productive yet. I've had breakfast and you know, shower, dress, made the bed, all that sort of stuff. And I have done one lot of grains for the dogs. Got another lot on the go now because I'm doing up some portions to freeze for my mum and dad who are going to have the Goldens uh, next week when I'm in hospital. Athena is actually going now in for ketamine. She had one or two going next week as well, but her mental health isn't very good and her anxiety gets really bad and she just feels that being, and being on the ketamine makes her feel a lot worse. So it makes her mental, mental self worse. I don't know if that makes sense. So at the moment she doesn't feel she's in a good enough place to go and have the infusion. That she doesn't think it'll. <laughs> she thinks it won't be it won't be good for her. So she's not going in. So that's kind of good for the golden or the griddles because they'll have a more company. Um, Christy will still be around, obviously, but um, these she's not in today, but she's home a lot. <laughs> So anyway, the pool is thankfully looking a lot better. Kevin went and did something to it yesterday. Um, don't mind Charlie and his coconut. Um, <laughs> so yeah, it looks a lot better now. I might even get in for this afternoon. What are you doing, Charlie boy? My goodness. <laughs> I've not seen that before. He plays at the top of it a lot, but I've not quite seen whatever he's doing to it right now. Yeah, we'll leave you in privacy, Charlie. We call it his coconut girlfriend. <laughs> anyway, moving on. Um, so yeah, I've got a few things to get done. I've got to do some more dog food. I've got to cook some vegetables for them. What else? I want to try and get through the freezers and make an inventory list. But again, it's not, not priority. The, the food's the main thing I'm working on today. Um, I've got to reload the snuffle mat because I had to do the snuffles this morning because... Coda was a bit out of control with his barking. He's being good right now, but he would not stop the smile. I don't even know what he was barking at. He was a bit crazy. I never actually got him those anti-anxiety um, medications that are recommended, but I think I'm going to. I think it's worth a try. Um, so I'll, I'm going to organise to get one of them. Just give it a try. See, because of the poor thing. I could just get so fixated on things and... It's very hard to distract him and in the mornings I'm not the best so it's very hard to deal with so after I yelled at him a bit and <laughs> stop I got the stuff on my dad that did work actually um, so that was good anyway let's get on with things oh and I real I went to this morning to um, make public the 31st of October it's not there so it's not a computer and I've shared it but obviously something went wrong in the uploading to YouTube. Either I just didn't do it or something went wrong. Who knows? But obviously that's on my laptop. So I'm going to have a look. I might redo the video for you, depending how involved it looks. It probably, probably won't be too bad one to do, I don't think. Um, I don't think we're too much editing. So I'll probably redo that one for you guys. So they can kind of go up in order and document your life is ready to go up. But that's kind of, that's more of a me thing. And I know some of you guys watch it, which I appreciate. Um, but it's more for, more for myself, but it's already done. And then I can move on to November. All right. Oh, um, what I was going to do, I'm going to do that this morning. Uh, I ended up having to have another, a lentil burger sandwich thing again this morning because I didn't get to do them yesterday because obviously the kitchen, I think I ended up saying it was a bit of a chaotic uh, day in the house. Because Ellie was cleaning, Fee was cooking, I was very happy to get in the kitchen. So I kind of got in to get my lunch made when they were having uh, outside eating. And then the rest of the afternoon, they were kind of in here. So I didn't get in to do my um, milk and overnight oats. So I'll do it today and that'll give me, that'll give me over the weekend as well. Hmm, maybe I'll just do three lots. What day is it? Did I say it was, it's a Wednesday already. Oh my goodness. So, oh yeah, I think I'll just do three. I'll do Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And um, the aunt's has some extra almond milk to make up some smoothies. So we'll, we will do that. At least um, I've missed it. I've got my raspberries there ready to go. <laughs>
this is quite the messy job <laughs> but as you can see I have got eight yeah I've got eight which is exactly what I need I'm in hospital for seven nights but oh okay so I need seven Duh. I'm thinking I was short I don't know why because <laughs> I have fibro and can't think properly obviously that's okay I can put one each in the freezer here and then that will be dinner for them the night I get out of hospital so I'll probably just take it over to mum's so we know we've got that dinner organized so yes I've got eight dinners for Bailey use the big bags for him small bags for Rosie but I didn't have enough so I've used I just couldn't be myself to use plastic the normal disposable plastic bags I'll just get mum to keep all these um, and we can use them again so I'll just use some of these um, stasher bags because obviously I'm not going to need them while I'm in hospital anyway yeah, so I've just used some of the stasher bags to finish off the eight for Rosie I'm just now cooking the vegetables and I'll add the vegetables to them and that's their complete meal so that should be quite easy for mum and dad um, hopefully the dry food will come in in time and they can supplement with a bit of dry food but mum tends to give them treats anyway so I'm sure that that will be enough food um, Mum overfeeds the dogs so we thought we'd better to divide them up because obviously Bailey has a bit more than Rosie and that makes it nice and easy for them. Since they're doing us a favour and having the Goldens I'm looking after them and put another lot of grains in the mic in the food processor, no pressure cooker, gosh I love this thing, this is my air fryer I love so much um, and this is just brilliant for doing the dogs food, <laughs> so good, so much easier than what we used to do. So I'll um, make up some more and I don't know if I can freeze any if I've got containers I can freeze some for them because I think Christy wanted me to do some for them but obviously I can use containers for them if I can find enough containers. Um, certainly on Sunday I'll be able to put some more together because I can use our glass containers as well but obviously one of that will do um, four dog dinners so two nights for the the griddles because they have about a quarter of that each night slightly less than a quarter but about, about a quarter again Kena has a bit more than Coda but he has dry food as well so the Coda doesn't get as much dry food anyway <laughs> good job done oh, underway so I'm going to divide up the vegetables that are cooked I've got more going and I'll chop up I'll wait till it's all finished I think then I'll chop up some more yeah but I'm, I'm happy with how it's all going. wait to import footage from well, it's actually Thursday the 31st uh, again <laughs> so, well that's importing I was just looking through I've got all my travel diary stuff here and I was thinking oh, do I really bother continuing because I've only got up to like day 13 so I've got you know, for, like almost two weeks to do but it's actually really good a lot of good information in here and I just discovered I've actually had an impossible burger I didn't even know I'd had one now I have to watch the video to find out what I think of it. I don't remember being very memorable, so who knows? I really don't know what to do with this. Like, this is so good where I have done stuff, like my little notes, and I like that I've written down what we had for meals and stuff. Like, that's really good, but then where I haven't written notes up, or like, I now don't know what to write. Like, this is going back nearly a year. Without like watching my videos again, maybe to get ideas from. So I'm kind of just thinking I might just, I don't know, maybe just use. Like that's, uh, I don't have got time to do that before we go away. I'm a bit annoyed with myself now that I didn't keep up, you know, 
with the journaling or something at least would have been good because then I would have some notes but um I might just cut up the brochures that I've got maybe print up some photos and just keep it as simple as I can and maybe if I get a chance I can watch the videos and take some notes I mean that's the kind of thing maybe I could do in, in hospital so yeah I think I'm going to try and finish it at least in somewhat and I actually really want to do this again I wasn't sure whether I wanted to do it again for this coming trip but now just having had a look through and a read through I do want to do it and it should be easier to hopefully keep up to date because I did really good until we we're on the road and then like we're out most of the day and then we're just in at night um and then it's sort of yeah obviously <laughs> I was tiring out so hopefully because we've got a cruise I can you know do stuff in the mornings or whatever and the thing is obviously on the cruise I won't be editing vlogs because I won't be able to upload them so I'm just going to edit some vlogs um, when we're at Vegas and I'll pro I might edit some while we're away still but I won't be trying to get one done every day kind of thing like I was here that would have been the priority would be editing a vlog to have it up to upload for you guys so yeah they'll just go up when they're done I guess well not on the cruise though and the cruise is 12 nights so <laughs> um, what I'll probably do is possibly spread out the Vegas ones a bit because I know everyone's busy at Christmas time anyway, so in a way it'll be pretty good to have them for after Christmas to go up. Because I know people are watching Vlogmas videos during December. Like, I would be if I was available. I have to watch very selectively some when I come home. Because I do enjoy Vlogmas too. That's why I love going away in, this time of year. I love it. Because especially going to America because everything's decorated for Christmas. So it's really nice. But I do miss seeing Vlogmas videos. <laughs> So I kind of watch some, um, but yeah, I have to be super selective of whose I watch. Anyway, I can't watch all the vlogmas videos every day. All right, um, well, it's still downloading. So I might go and investigate one of the freezers and start to make a list of what's in there. That way after hospital, I'll have my list of foods to be trying to use up as said I'm actually not going to do any more food prep now the one this week for monday will have been the last one i'll do and the way next in hospital next week kevin's away and then he's away most of the next two weeks after that and i'm just going to be eating out the freezer and the pantry just getting fresh foods where i need it and really trying to just use up what we have so i want to make a list of what there is so i know so that i can select and i'll just do my yeah, I won't be doing any food prep besides my salads and that. Well, overnight oats still, of course. <laughs> and yeah, just dinners will be from what we already have made up or to use up or a simple meal thrown together kind of thing, like rice bowls and stuff that Kevin doesn't really eat. Um, just, yeah, using up, not um, much more cooking. But it'll be kind of nice actually, because again, that'll give me a little bit more time to do some more decluttering um not a lot of decluttering to do but just to do the old jobs and just kind of have a nice ease into holiday mode i feel like i'm already in holiday mode funnily enough i don't know why i think because of not having to clean the house and getting what food prepped on a monday like the rest of the week kind of seems a bit breezy um like we did a lot pottering around doing all the, the food prep and stuff like for the dogs like that's nice Anyway, I'll, um, yeah, head to the freezer now. He was sitting by the front door looking out with his little comfort toy. Little comfort. And I was going to take a video or a photo, but I took the, that camera through and then obviously the card is in the computer. So that was a bit of a fail. And then he, he heard me, so he's now through here. I love how he has his little comforts. He's so cute. He's so cute, little bear. Stocking up on all the extra pats and cuddles this week. And I'm pleased to report this room is still nice and tidy. It's good, isn't it? <laughs> Just took my shoes off, that's why they're there. These got some bags there, but okay. Let's delve in here, make a list. There is actually some space, so I have actually been already starting on things, but I've also got like these. Frozen meals I bought for Kevin and every time I say to Kevin do you want one he goes no so I think I'm going to try and eat them up too I'll eat the other stuff probably first and then that will be last I'll check dates and stuff as well see how things are going 
but I'm gonna pull everything out and then I make my list and yeah, see where we go from there. I actually meant to show you everything when I got it out, but I forgot. But I have got my list. So pretty much this whole container is all like packaged foods. <laughs> um, so I've written everything down. Oh, no, this is what I'm talking about. Half of it is actually homemade meals. So they're the ones I'll probably work on first to get through. Um, a few things like the vegetarian sausage rolls, Kevin's not a fan of, so I'll eat them. And then I'll keep these ones we haven't tried yet. So I'll try and eat the stuff that I don't think Kevin is particularly keen on. And then these go to like a long time, so I'll probably keep them because they would be handy. I know, I know why Kevin didn't want them because he's gone right off rice at the moment. So that's probably why he didn't want them. But I'll leave them there. I can also let Thee know that they're there too and that they might want them sometime. And obviously our Guardian things are there. I'm just going to put this pasta. It's our last of our filled pasta. Pop that into a different bag. And then I've pulled out the fajita mix, which we are actually having for dinner. Um, I can't remember if I've cooked it or not. I guess I'll see what it defrosts, I guess. Um, <laughs> having for dinner tomorrow night. So I'll pull that out of the freezer as well. And I've just stuck the vegetables. Looks like Coda's going to clean the drawer of crumbs for me. Uh, yeah, he did. Thank you, Coda Bear. <laughs> I was going to go and wash it out. I still will wash it out. But there are, are no, longer, no, no longer a pile of crumbs there. Thanks, mate. Did a good job there, Coda. <laughs> so I've just stuck the vegetables that came out of there for there for now. Um, yeah. So I'll go and deal with this and then I've got that other freezer in the kitchen. But that will not take very long at all. I've been putting this off for ages. But now I've got my list that I can work on. Okay, bit of an update. I've finished all the dog food. D Dad came over with the mail so he's taken over the stuff to the next door. So that's the golden sorted out for next week and I'll sort out the griddles on Sunday. <laughs> And yeah, I've got my almond milk done, my overnight oats done, and I've got milk for two smoothies. So I'll make sure I have those smoothies. Um, so warm. Uh, Sorry. It's okay. So I'm just having a bit of trouble with the computer I'm trying to reboot it at the moment so I can look at those videos. I don't know what's going on. It was something exciting, Mum. What? My license. I'm covering now, oh. just don't worry. Too many photos. It's the same photos before. Very serious. I didn't get any <laughs> So Christy's on her what red peas well, now? And Thee's on her black license, which is no peas. As well. So So always something exciting. That's good. It's always a good to get exciting mail. Uh, rather than just silly mail. Anyway, I'm gonna try and get this sorted. Um, fiddle around on the computer for a little bit for half an hour or so. Then I'm going to my lunch, another salad, and I'm going to sit out by the pool. We're going to go like, have a swim and lie out by the pool. It's probably not about 3 o'clock when the sun's not as strong. So, and I don't want to get sunburnt. Well, there is today's salad. Sadly, when I went to get a mango, none of them were ripe. <laughs> I gave Kevin one today for lunch, and I think Ellie had one for lunch. So, I just added some pineapple instead. So, and it'll still be nice, just not as nice. I'm with six mangoes there, just none of them are ready. I was going to sit outside, but it's quite warm. I think it's like 28 degrees now. So it's a bit warm outside, so I'm in front of the fan here. And I'm actually... I think I'll eat my lunch, and then I'm going to actually finish my book on my Kindle, because I've nearly finished. I just fell asleep last night, didn't quite get through it. And I'll probably just watch a bit of YouTube, and then I want to um, go work on that video again. Do some jigsaw. Well, I've finished work for the day now, so we just got to put really my feet up. trouble getting stuff to 
put in the video. And I just happened to look over on my desktop. There's the video. It must copy this from my laptop. Because there it is. For some reason, this video is 28 minutes. The other one I just edited was only 20 minutes. But it's there. Oh my gosh. Okay, well that saves me a fair bit of time. Oh, could have saved me more time, but it saves me... Still saves me more time. Oh my gosh. I just happened to notice the July Poppy ones. I thought, that's one I was working on. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh dear. Oh well. That's good, I guess. <laughs> Let's just get the full video now.
Well, that was super nice and super enjoyable. I hope we got some good footage of, of Kino in the pool. Stupid Siri is playing some music I did not ask her to play. I was yelling out to Bailey, he was, waiting, he was barking outside and I was telling her to be patient and then Siri decided she had to play me some music. It's not my kind of music. <laughs> now she won't be quiet. Sorry if you guys, I should have said, I should have spelled it out because it drives me bonkers when someone says things. Although I don't think I said a command. Um, <laughs> it drives me bonkers when someone says it in a video and then you things start going. <laughs> anyway. I'm going to get a drink in a sec. I'm probably going to work on my puzzle now that I know that video is there and I'll get Kevin to help me with it when he comes home because I don't think I've got Chrome. I use Google Chrome and I don't think it's on this lap desktop. So, and Firefox isn't working, so we thought I used to use here. So, the dogs are touching us time out there. It was really nice. So, yeah, that was, that was fun. I didn't get through my book because Christy was with me, but that's okay. I'll finish it tonight when I go to bed. So, there's tonight's dinner. I've got two of the zucchini and corn fritters and some mashed sweet potato that I had put in the freezer so that was a really nice easy dinner just reheated the fritters in the air fryer which made them that was easy as well